good afternoon my dear students <coughs> hope you are all well by the grace of almighty allah we are really grateful to him till now we are able to join classes and take part in our study students i can see you are joining with me now i want to know whether the sound is clear and also the screen is seen clearly <coughs> students can you see the screen clearly and also the sound is clear please write in the comment box <coughs> with those are not ishrak musharrat uzma is it okay everything is clear sir okay so i have got green signal i can go ahead now and i am waiting for the students to join i think this class will do something helpful for you so don't miss the class <coughs> you are given sit uh, right curriculum vitae vitae actually it is in your syllabus but but we could not discuss it in the class because of unusual vacation now we are enjoying or we are staying at home so i will say i must say today you will be you will get some idea about it so that you will be able to understand uh, the difference of how to uh, the difference of difference different kind of cb writing okay you can in the screen you can see you can see students <coughs> curriculum beta usually we prepare a such curriculum beta to apply for a job we to send something my information to another one and many other causes you know in america it is called resume in bangladesh some people write it once we wrote it by data so curriculum beta and resume and also by data they have different this is what today i would like to discuss on curriculum beta that is you will learn how to apply for a job or such kinds of purposes so in order to write a good cb you should follow the following whenever you write a cb remember it is pick the best format cb format pick the best cb format remember it is it does not mean that you will write a cb uh, uh, that is not clear but format is not okay cover letter is not given properly it is that you will write a cb where you will follow the good format pick the best format that is you want to attract the employer you want to attract someone else so try yourself to use such kinds of policy that's why you pick the best cb format next one add your contact information in the right way contact information in the right way clumsy not or not irregular way not uh, in discipline way just contact information the right way that is add your contact information in the right way i will show it now start with a cv personal profile profile 
start with a CV personal profile and that is your uh, your your name personal profile e uh, email id and that's all and some phone, mobile number list your relevant work experience and it is our key achievement huh. uh, relevant work experience that is uh, you here another one other point is not given give your or put your educational qualification it is not written here i think you should use it i think okay oh yes next one is this list your relevant work experience i think it you can give it last in bangladesh it is given in the last but i have written here uh, so that is list your relevant work experience and key achievements that is uh, the job which you are interested job which you want to do is it relevant to your application you will see it later uh, sometimes we apply for uh, accounts officer sometimes we apply for IT officer sometimes you apply for a teacher sometimes you apply for uh, uh, for uh, uh, PRO public relation officer all jo job uh, places are purpose different because a teacher need some kinds of word English teacher math teacher chemistry teacher physics teacher so your CV will be different at least the qualification must be different so remember it is if you write a cb on uh, if you write a cb on, on or for if you write a cb for account officer you must uh, present your educational qualification and some other information relevant to account officer okay list build your cb education section correctly that is which kinds of graduation degree you have, which kinds of degrees are, yeah, you have, that is, okay. Put irrelevant skills that fit the job opening. Suppose you want to, uh, you are applying for teaching profession, that is English teacher. Here, uh, sometimes you have good knowledge on computer, but your first priority is you, you are applying for the post of an English teacher. So you will highlight, you will present ab about English qualification. And if you have other qualification, you will present it or you will write it last section of the application or next point. Okay. Put relevant skills that fit the job opening. Okay. Include additional CV sections to impress the recruiter. And now another thing, you are a good player, you, 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 good, uh, you can play. Uh, uh, you are a good soccer and a, you are a, you are a uh, good athletic you are good uh, scout you you had this quality of scout so you can add it and if you can think it is extra quality you can show it organize this all on his professional tempo that, that is whenever you have prepared you this and try yourself to uh, organize it professional temple that is being on a systematic way and then complete your CV with a cover letter. So cover letter is application that is it will show it to you. So here I have tried to, to give you the conception that here I have tried to give you the conception that to what will you do to write a good CV. Remember it is, you are writing the CV to draw the attention of your employer, so it is very much important to make it attractive and it does not mean that you will use attractive color, it means that you will use attractive format, attractive format and that is called uh, cover letter, uh, that is called good CV presentation or good CV. Okay. I have also written something about what is a CV. What is a CV? In its, its full form, CV stands for curriculum beta, uh, Latin as a course of life. Latin for course of life. In the US, Canada, and Australia, a CV is a document you use for academic purposes. The US academic CV outlines every detail of your scholarly career. But in our country, 
in other countries cb is an equivalent of an american resume you use it when you apply for a job so i think you can understand uh, uh, cb uh, purpose and cb purpose in our country and uh, now i shall discuss on how to write a cover letter in bangladesh uh, in our in the classes we are we teach cb first you will write a cover letter that is application cover letter means application okay write cb with a cover letter that is cv here i will write cb cv on it officer it is in your syllabus here i repeat here i will write cb on it officer a job on it officer a job and it officer so remember it is it officer means this person is um, has qualification qualification on ict ict uh, based education that is he has ict uh, information technology degree he, this is so first we shall write c uh, cover letter that what will you do i think you can see may to 8 or october 8 uh, that something else october october 8 2020 the head adver adver advertiser the public relation office manager vaccine cooper mall limited remember it is it is a sample i repeat it is a sample so if you write to um, you leverage you to write to citizen group of company if you write to fartes group of company if you write to cities bank city cell limited if you write to bangladesh limited then you will use this address now it is a sample i have here written the advertiser or the public relation officer anyone whenever you write you will write and you will address one the advertiser or the public relation officer or manager of the company okay some some cases whenever you will get the advertisement in the paper you will see the advertisers and also instructions uh, instruction is given home to apply home to apply পত্রিকায় যখন দেওয়া হয় তখন এই কথাগুলো বলা হয় যে এটা কাকে দরখাস্ত করবে সেক্ষেত্রে হোয়েন এভার ইউ রাইট হোয়েন এভার ইউ রাইট দ্য পেপার অলসো ইউ উইল সি হোম টু অ্যাপ্লাই হিয়ার ইট ইজ এম্পল আই হ্যাভ বিটেন সাবজেক্ট ফর দ্য পোস্ট অফ আই সি টি অফিসার অর সরি আই টি অফিসার ফর দ্য পোস্ট অফ এন আই টি অফিসার আই টি ইনফরমেশন অ্যান্ড টেকনোলজি অফিসার বিকজ ইন দ্য কোয়েশ্চেন write an write an application or cover write a cover letter for the post of an it officer so you will address it and accordingly and also post of it officer there are different kinds of writing uh, this application it is not that what i have written here it will be this but i would say uh, if you simply follow Uh, me i do two application i have written here to different way i think you will be benefited because in some books uh, they are written different way sometimes um, uh, it is it is tough to understand it is not uh, suitable to apply so please look from the advertisement in the daily star dated at uh, dated 16 and october I come to know that you are going to recruit an IT officer at your office. I affirm myself as a candidate for the post. Somewhere, some uh, books are written more than that. Okay, that is the question. But remember, it is which uh, whenever you write, try yourself to uh, to make it suitable according to the demand of the application. Okay, my CV and other necessary documents are. and close to the application for your kind inspection or you can say consideration or your perusal so students i know you are very much known to this type of uh, application yet application for job uh, cover letter and 
usual application has some different so try yourself to learn it okay you sincerely shahidul islam and you will write a signature i think you will write or you put a signature put you will put a signature okay you put a signature that's all now let us try to see how to write curriculum beta curriculum beta one this one is i support i support this but you can write another way curriculum beta mohammad rizal islam address uh, this mobile number and also email nowadays it is very much nowadays it is very much uh, necessary to mention your email id or email address students uh, jara paul shama please please don't uh, join with each other just try yourself to it okay now you are going to write cb who is who cb it is rezaul islam so mohammad rezaul islam i think my name is given here so uh, if you don't write this name here it is it it may not problem so rezaul islam i think this this should be deleted so oh, okay because name is written here now father's name mohammad raisul islam okay it is a sample first one name is written so no need to write name here here father's name mohammad raisul islam mother's name shubharna islam and address present address here is given now that's why here permanent address village sir lawrence post hatir hazirhat thana kamalnagar dist lakshmipur bangladesh that is you are have written some information about your family profile your profile understand so you have written your profile now <coughs> let's go i think you are very much accustomed to this so or you are very much familiar about this figure okay educational background or education education okay since you are applying for ict since you are applying for ict oh uh, sorry it post that is information technology officer so your uh, focal point will be there you will write related to your degree on this if you have no degree on it ict you cannot uh, apply so it is a point let's go Ex examination board of university year gpa or gcgpa or group and subject let us that is advanced course on ict remember students this is one format you can some students write uh, down up down standard degree and also university that is not a mistake i think if you arrange it if you can arrange it systematically okay if you have any comment you can share here or uh, okay yusha hasan gum theke okay now educational background or education uh, advanced course on ict because you are applying ict or it post and uh, from which university or board you have passed it is in masha university malaysia and year 2016 gpa ittadi so, dot dot and again bsc bsc degree uh, on ict bsc on ict and it uh, i think you can say i c t hmm. so bsc ict khulna engineering university 2012 and also your cgp or gpa numbers hsc uh, hsc dhaka board and 2008 at uh, this hsc dhaka board 2006 this now you have written your education okay now since you since you have uh already presented main points now you can present your experience okay what kind of experience you have 
I have been serving an IT officer in Lamia group of company that is company uh, I have been okay for the l last two years number 10 excellent knowledge on computer maintenance internet browsing and typing Bengali and English excellent knowledge on computer maintenance internet browsing and typing and excellent fluency in English and language Bangla English and France but fluency I think no need to say excellent fluency it is fluency fluent 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 in Bangla is English and France language okay and last one hobby reading books traveling and if someone write uh, foot, playing football cricket that is different and it was clear so education background experience now I want to show you the full skill for first it, you will write cover letter and second you will present CV so it is ICT or IT IT officer now let us go next one writing CV on medical officer that is you want uh, you are applying as for a post which is which is a medical uh, officer first so now your knowledge your educational background must be doc, uh, doctor or this must be doctor or uh, uh, biochemistry uh, sorry uh, applied chemistry or such as this types of so I think mostly it is doctor now uh, that you are writing CV on medical officer okay writing CV on medical officer date May 2 this or this that the, the advantage of the public relation officer manager or anyone else the uh, director general or the chairman no problem Acme Limited it is another company actually you know it Dhaka subject for the post of a medical officer okay sir in this in previous uh, cover letter I showed you another form format now here uh, you can see uh, a different kind of in response to your advertisement published in the observer you know observe is a newspaper on 20th October 2020 I would like to apply for the post of a medical officer of a medical officer I'm interested in pursuing my career as a doctor I'm interested in pursuing myself as a doctor since the completion of my graduation I have been I have been working in the city hospital it is one of that is it is his experience I'm interested in working in your hospital as it will not it will not only enable me to work in better employment but also help me flourish my capability so it is different thing actually whenever um, you want a better job whenever you select an, a job which is who is exceed the previous one so it is this so I am interested in working in your hospital as it will not only enable me to work in a better environment but also help me flourish my capability okay my CV and other necessary equipments are enclosed to the application for your kind inspection or find okay you sincerely and I think you can write here signature here also Shahidul Islam but you can write support my name is Ismail Hashayil okay signature and if you write here Ismail Hashem so here my name will be Ismail okay so you can see this curriculum bit of R R
โอเคดิคริคูลัมบิเจ Here, this the previous format is one one format. It is another format, and I think you can write here. Mama Dismanushen, Zamaluddin, Jasmine Akhtar, present address because here you need to write all detail here. So present address and permanent address, nationality, Islam, Sunni, and date of birth. Uh, actually, it is. Uh, I am so much old. It is twenty. Twenty one zero five nineteen hundred ninety eight. Suppose so. Date of birth and also again educational background or educational. Qualification. Clear. Okay. Same case here. There I have written about ICT based experience. Now here I I I have written on different thing. You can see. Uh, you can see here. Educational qualification. Okay. Examination. Board or university, and also year, division, group, subject, section. Here, the, this man is interested to get a, a medical official job. So, med, yes, medical official job. So here his degree would be MBBS or MBBS. University of Dhaka and B.Sc. The actually uh, and M M.B.B.S. and F.C.P.S. I think you can write here M.B.B.S. University of Dhaka here F.C.P.S. Now F.C.P.S. It is from you can say from Bangabandhu Medical College. Bangla Bandhu Medical College and Hospital. Okay, so FCPS degree it is also a special quality. So education, examination, exam. FCPS Bangla Desh Medical College. That's all. And also, I think I have given here a score point, and you will try to write it. The students, I can see uh, the number of st presents is decreasing. I don't know what is your important job now, whether the class or roaming here and there. I will. I believe that you will miss something. Okay, educational qualification or education, and you will again write since it is medical officer, so your Matter is different, and you will try to write something the degree on medical officer. Okay, so examination, board university year, and that's all. FCPS degree, Bangabandhu Medical College and Hospital year 2016. Division or uh, obtain division, obtain division. Uh, what is our uh, group subject session? That is, and number of MBBS, HSC, HSC. So you can see here. Uh, qualification of a candidate. So the qualification is different. A previous qualification is on ICT based, that is computer. Now this quali this is here uh, on medical officer based, doctor based. Now let us try. Only I will discuss only other uh, other. Questions that is which are given in your syllabus. Write a CV with a cover letter from the from the post of an accounts officer. Actually, how will you write cover letter? I will. I have showed it. I have shown it to you. Now I just want. What will be the change in case of account officer? 
now again i repeat account officer that is account officer he if he wants to be an account officer uh, i think his degree will be on management um, or uh, degree will be uh, accounting and also this type of degree account officer and i think it in in this cases you need not to get master and account officer graduation is a suppose honors graduation or graduation is not uh, not bad so uh, it does not mean that you will need to write uh, m com m c m com in uh, in management m com in uh, i think what is you say m com in accounting just you need hsc and hsc will be same now problem is that account officer that is ba or bcom b com remember it is account officer uh, does not need to be degree of master degree because although we mention it okay it is from uh, national university okay you write it national university university here i think this and what is your ex computer science actually it is not this it is uh, it is actually how it will be um, it is with accounts officer groups commerce okay again mcom you can write mcom on management of the body mcom uh, it is from uh, university of national university national here you can change it because the degree you have obtained you know uh, what is the year so you will change you can change it and group subject i think commerce and here one thing hsc hsc degree can be from commerce can be from science but uh, usually it is from commerce so you can say commerce but it is not that you, yeah because science students can take commerce subject in hsc level and so it is it can be uh, same so here i have shown you another format and the post is account officer here uh, civil letter is really same just uh, whenever you write medical officer uh, for the case of medical officer post the, but when we write account uh, accounts officer for the post of account officer post i i think i could uh, i can able to understand you to realize you what the purpose um, of this class what is the purpose of this class please uh, don't forget to give attention so accounts officer i just here given only education education okay education i, I this uh, conception that is if you are educated or if your education is commerce based you can think that you will get degree uh, you will get job on bank case accounts officer that's all or uh, if you as science based you will get degree uh, on uh, medical officer i think i think mro medical representative or representative officer by mr mr medical representative so degree also very much need to understand which type of uh, job suit is suitable for you again okay here experience i have been serving as an officer and of an account officer but accountant account officer in lamia group you can say lamia i uh, don't need to write you say uh, you say vijay group and vijay properties vijay properties and developers limited and sorry tv developers limited from for the last 2 years for the last 2 years i have been serving as an account another thing your your hobby 
your ex uh, your expertness on computer and other things you will add no problem but here it it, it, it is also it experience case you must show the experience but what is of working in a company is from is also one kind of experience because experience help you to suit to shoot up another job here it is commerce based so i have written this now question number five write a cv with a cover letter as a newscaster as a newscaster newscaster is a i think those who cast news basically their education is journalism based so hcc dhaka that is not problem science commerce no problem but when you will say bsc newscaster is a journalism post it is i think commerce faculty uh, arts faculty post i say ba on journalism journalism okay and it is khulna engineering khulna university though you can say khulna university okay again uh, ma on journalism uh, okay so since your job is newscaster so your rela job relation is of course uh, uh, from news journalism based here newscaster uh, masters and also uh, ba this is also very high quality degree so most cases it does not mean that you will mention it but here and now university university you can say rashi university Rajshahi, Rajshahi University. Here you can change it, and also degree GP point you can change it. Now this is this is journalism degree. It is uh, group subject. I think it is uh, journalism is subject. so which group i think it is arts so some sometimes it does not mean to mention it is not necessary to mention it because arts science it is not problem problem is you have degree on this journalism or uh, for doing the news cluster first okay and other things experience i have been serving i have been working okay as a as a uh, news caster as a news caster hmm in to the in uh, the, uh, as a news caster in jomuna uh, tv limited jomuna television Did you get television for the last five years or three years or four years? No problem. Four years, suppose it is four years. This is and other things. Cover letter. I repeat, cover letter and other things are same. So uh, I think you can understand, students. I think you have understood um, actually what. Are the changes necessary when your question will change for writing on uh, writing application to uh, for for a post for writing application for a post to someone else some other person manager director that is the question. But what will be the uh, format? What will be the format? It is the education qualification. It is these. Okay. it is this education now you can see uh, hsc hsc and ba or ma journalism and be sure 
about it be sure about it if you write your education qualification or also experience and some other point I have given you some, some other point students in your syllabus there are five CV either uh, here uh, CV writing and actually last one is I have missed and I think uh, what I have discussed here uh, will will do or in will influence you to prepare for the examination usually in Bangladesh this curriculum system uh, this curriculum beta is written this type of curriculum beta is written so I must suggest you to follow it curriculum beta remember it is it's try yourself to make it attractive try yourself to make it attractive okay it is very much necessary students so five uh, five CVs are in your syllabus from August September October I have discussed all if you have any question you can if you have any query if you have any any thing to know uh, I think repeat or um, watch the class the this video again it will be uh, uploaded or it, it will be in your site now I want to mention other things I want to mention other things uh, it is writing part I want to mention other things it is writing part that is writing part that is I have already uploaded this PDF file I have already uploaded this PDF file to in our in this class 9 site please download it and read the composition application email from them I repeat uh, I have already uploaded some uh, some writing writings that is ap uh, application composition and as well and some others here uh, I am trying to show it Appli a letter to the manager of bank for opening an account okay uh, it, it is uploaded already so I think you will get there if there is any sanctions of punctuation mistake or something that please try to correct it this this file is uploaded this file is this file is uploaded uh, as a PDF file and please students please try to learn them uh, during the during the puja vacation it is a vacation but you have time remember it is if you only go through the if you only go through the whole text you will get an idea about this another thing I want to remind you uh, here I have uploaded two composition a journey by boat a journey by bus and also a journey by train it is because you can see in your syllabus it is written a journey by you have made recently the syllabus is a journey you have made recently so you will try to source one and describe yourself a journey you have made recently okay and you will say journey is journey make a call going out for a journey is my pleasure I am very much interested for making a journey whenever I get an opportunity I go out uh, with my car or uh, I go to visit my uncle's house aunt's house just to enjoy journey hmm but I like uh, I like to enjoy journey by boat very much or I like to enjoy journey by bus very much or I like to enjoy journey by train and after that you will write what you did what have you enjoyed it is so here three compositions are given only for your advantage use benefit so that you can choose one and if you think that any problem write in the comment box after reading this I will try to upload directly or directly the others okay again visit to a place of interest last class I told you uh, what is the importance of uh, adults newspaper 
television use and abuse of television that is here i have given two composition one is television another is uses and abuses of television so i believe you will uh, try to amalgamate to mix the ideas so that you can write good one because television means you will write only on television its its uh, historical background its purpose its but whenever you write use and abuse of television then you need to write something about the use and abuse so i believe that only te television composition is not uh, is not um, in your conception whenever you write television you will you will write to you will try to write some uses and abuses or merits and demerits or bad side or good side of tell using television i again repeat whenever you write television only you will write the background of television and development of uh, generation television generation and also use of television and use of watching uh, use of uh, watching television uh, misuse uh, misuser i think uh, abuses of using television that is it so you write so uh, that's why i have written here two composition and i think you will go through this and try yourself to write one one thing is that our students are quite good in english so they can easily write something in english but to write something or to write a composition you need to gather knowledge on the topic that is why you need to read you need to observe the matter you always see a cow but if you are told to write about a cow you may write some sentences again uh, another person writes many many sentences it is because he is he is looking his observation and his uh, interesting mood helps him to write this kinds of composition whereas if i tell someone uh, a student if he has not good idea he may say a cow has four, four legs two ear two eyes and he is blah 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 in fact your observation and you uh, can be different and your exams be big if you look the matter look into the matter minutely and then you can write something there. that is why whenever you write a composition be careful about it and that's all application i have showed you and paragraph i have given you i think paragraphs are also given yes necessity of learning english load shedding the t the postman or postman a street hawker i think next class i will discuss on these topics okay please if you have any comment any concept any misunderstanding try to share it i will try to give you a solution and i also um say want to say that this i notes i have made uh in one day so i may have some uh, limitation or silly mistake please uh, try yourself to ignore it or don't try yourself to ignore about the mistake just correct it and study for the exam thanks a lot to all of my students those who are with me for a long time i must be grateful to my guardians and 47 students or i think 50 students or 55 students yeah, please be careful about your duty and responsibility navin mauli wa alaikum assalam shadia jaman thank you and abdus sarur as wa alaikum assalam allah hafiz navin mauli yasin ami thank you shadia thank you uzma udia thank you sir please cv pdf then i am sorry i will do it later because it is something tough rintu hussain allah hafiz uh, abrahim rahim thank you allah hafiz uh, uzma udia allah hafiz sanjida miss thank you sir sadia mahzabin thank you 
কাজির হোসেন থ্যাংক ইউ ফারহান কবির থ্যাংক ইউ আয়সা হোসেন থ্যাংক ইউ ওয়ালাইকুম আসসালাম আয়সা কাজী ফুরসাম জাহিন সালাভি রহমিয়া থ্যাংক ইউ স্যার ওকে ওয়েলকাম ওয়েলকাম অ্যান্ড মালিহা মাহফুজ ওয়েল ওয়ালাইকুম আসসালাম ওয়ালাইকুম আসসালাম সালসাবিল রাবিহা ওয়ালাইকুম আসসালাম সঞ্জি সাজেদা নাবির মুড়ি আগিন ফাইজা করিম ওয়েলকাম সঞ্জিদা মিস থ্যাংক ইউ ওকে সঞ্জিদা মিস ইজ মাই মাই গুড সাপোর্ট অ্যান্ড হি সে শি সে ইজ গুড গ্রেট ক্লাস বাট স্টুডেন্টস ইউ আর নট জয়নিং ইউ শুড জয়েন অল দ্য স্টুডেন্টস শুড জয়েন টু এনজয় দ্য ক্লাস আই বিলিভ দিস ক্লাস ওয়াজ হেল্পফুল ফারহান জারিফ থ্যাংক ইউ গুড লাক অল অফ ইউ আসসালাম আলাইকুম অল দ্য অডিয়েন্স অ্যান্ড আসসালামু আলাইকুম সঞ্জিদা মিস বাই বাই